yes, no. About some questions I'm going to figure out after this. So pretty much they got paid off to start stuff. Yes. Lena has a part in getting paid off. Yes. They shocked they got caught. Yes. Someone on their Facebook got them caught. Yes. So it's somebody on their Facebook who got them in the mess of what's going on. So I'm going to find out why and a little bit what is going on to why to why they got paid off to start trouble and there was the other night I heard a rattlesnake at that too snakes are wisdom protection rebirth fertility healing renewal Primal energy, evil power, and chaos from the underworld rattling tell the intruder to retreat from its territory, warning to caution approaching enemies. So, the enemies are not taking caution of how they approach <clears throat> their enemies. So, pretty much these people don't care if they cause you death, destruction, evil, poison, temptation, the devil, and deceit. So, don't make threaten, threatening moves of the snake, nor rattle before they strike. So, these enemies don't understand that they played with fire. And the Greek god, Manessa, goddess of snake, northeastern India, the cure of a snake bites. An ancient Egyptian demon of aches, a popus, threatened the underworld evil. So Shiva, Minotaur. Shiva, snake around the neck, cycle of birth and death, reminds to keep their ego under control. Snakes hunt at night. The rattling let the intruders know they too close. Warning signal between 660 and 100 hertz. Not aggressive and won't chase you. They strike when threatened. To warn off predators, possible attackers, gets close. Warn humans away. So pretty much enemies don't have a realization to back off of people. They are threatened by underworld and evil, by poison, attempt, temptation, evil, deceit. They are scared of getting struck at and will be stopped in their tracks they don't care about approaching the caution of a enemy's death destruction so these people don't care of what they done and they're scared of getting striked at these people are warned to back off shiva is my ancestor you got my you you got shiva up in here i've talked about shiva before pretty much Shiva is pretty much a warning telling the enemies to approach with caution and needs to back off or they're going to get struck at because pretty much Shiva is telling me my ancestors telling me right now that these people got paid off to do some really bad shit and that's kind of weird how another terror reader picked up on somebody plotting and planning. That's what Shiva is also picking up on too. That the enemies are not very smart right now. And they're shocked that they're caught. That they got caught getting paid to cause trouble.
And you can't really be doing that because somebody paid you off. It's like if somebody paid you off to go jump off a bridge, are you going to do it? It's like monkey see, monkey do. And the reasons why I say Shiva, my ancestor, is involved is because there's some type of pattern. Shiva is saying that the enemy's ego is going to be put in check. It needs to be under control. And also it's a warning that the enemies are being reckless. They don't care if it causes you death, hurt, pain, <laughs> agony, chaos. But these people are scared of the underworld and is scared of deceit. Because they're doing it. The snake and Shiva runs off evil people. Even the devil. The evil shit. Shiva's the one that pretty much talks about protection from any evil stuff. And I think it's kind of funny how Shiva hasn't popped up for a very long time. And I know others have ancestors that are Shiva. That's a very powerful ancestor. So anybody who has Shiva that has to deal with uh, Shiva having a snake around the neck is saying that they're trying to protect you letting these people know they're getting too close in your bubble space to caution them to back off because they're the devil they're evil and they're going to be struck at and that's what they're scared of pretty much so pretty much from being paid off so from people so from people getting paid off they're mad they got caught in the mix and there's people in denial that you want to cause path of destruction they shocked they got caught and I hate to tell you this Somebody on your guys' Facebook got you caught up. Somebody is being a snake towards your back. They're trying to get you to do something so it don't fall back on you. It's one of your guys' friends on Facebook who's betraying you and started some shit. And you got paid off by somebody on your Facebook. Or somebody else got paid off. That's where it usually starts. Because I've had an issue before that people got paid off to start on me. And that is legit. And it's not the first time I've heard of people trying to pay somebody off to get me killed. Try to get me hurt. Or trying to get some fucked up shit going on. You actually want to know what I think? By you people giving the energy to me like this. Purposely doing this. And purposely everything you just admitted to Shiva my ancestor that you got paid off to cause me trouble and Cody that's not the first time I've dealt with this it is not my first time somebody got paid to cause chaos and I promise you those people had karma in the end I promise you that and you guys think you're hot shit, but somebody secretly hates you guys to where they're blaming you guys where it's not the correct person. That's your guys' problem, not mine. So that's plotting and scheming. So that's also clarification of what Shiva is talking about because I commented on a guy's tarot actual video right here. I commented on his page because of what he clarified. And this is what Shiva is also clarifying. That there's something going on that somebody is screwing themselves. And you guys are shocked that you guys got caught of getting paid to start on me and Cody. That's where it usually starts. When people start on me and Cody, these people usually get bribed. They get paid. Or there's a hitman involved. Yeah. 
I'm not stupid. I wasn't born yesterday, which a lot of people don't understand that. And I think it's kind of funny how you guys want to sit there and keep provoking, keep provoking, but want to play victim of not understanding that I got eyes and ears everywhere that pretty much mentioned your guys' name of saying that you guys got paid off. To start on me and Cody. And you guys are being blamed wrongfully for it. That you guys got paid off to start on me and Cody. And you better find out who the perpetrator is. Because this is a problem. I'm clairvoyant. Shiva, my ancestor, would not lie to me. You know what I mean? This is some fucked up shit. But I want to find out... What, what type of shit are these people blaming you for that you guys are going to go down for? That you guys better get a fix. What? Who? Actually, I want to know. What are people blaming you guys about, actually? If something don't feel right, don't ignore it. Yes, thank you. Thank you, Shiva. Exactly. If something don't feel right, you don't ignore it. And there's people, like these two, are asleep right now. They don't give a damn. They don't care, which they should. You do have a right to stand your ground and protect your energy if something is off. Yes. Yes, I do. Because there's something off. And if you are very, very in tune... With your intuition, you will know shit. If you're clairvoyant, you will know. And if you know something ain't right, usually half the time whenever I talk about something, I'm usually right. I'm usually correct. And that's when people get shocked because they got caught. So there's people trying to tell me that I can't be right on my feeling. Well, that ain't your choice. Somebody is being a part of setting somebody up. To prove a point, be careful who is around you, have not seen before, or someone acting odd. And that's clarification to what the fuck I just said. There's a setup going on. There's somebody trying to prove a point. If someone's acting odd. That just clarified... What I just talked about and what Shiva's been talking about. And it clarified with another reader. Right there. Dead family members are trying to help you warn you that what the living is doing to hurt harm to give you a heads up. Yep. Like I said. Dead family members are here to help warn what the living is doing. That others are trying to do harm, hurt, to give you a heads up. And you can't really make this shit up to me because I've been talking about it. And I've already confronted a woman about this. That there's hurt, harm involved. There's somebody setting you two up and played you guys to go down for something that they did. You guys are being wrongfully accused. So meaning that whoever paid you guys off is going to get off easy while you guys have to deal with the consequences. That's sad, actually. Don't fuck with my energy. Yeah. Each time people have messed with my spiritual gifts, spiritual waters, or messed with my energy, I usually know what you're about. Girl, guess who just blocked me? Yeah. So, Lena is bragging about that she blocked me. They trying to embarrass you and it backfired on them being a clown. Yeah. So, these people were trying to say, oh, your fiance's cheating on you and yada yada this. Well, guess what? Somebody got set up. Somebody got paid to fuck with me and Cody. You trying to embarrass me, you embarrass the fuck out of yourselves. And I did confront this J, whatever the fuck her name is, over here with the J-I-J-A, whatever. 
Why, eh? I confronted her that she just embarrassed herself and this bitch embarrassed herself for trying to embarrass me. It backfired on you guys because there's a setup here. So somebody set you two up. Now, you trying to embarrass me, it backfired on you because in my yes or no's, the question was, they shocked they got caught. Yes. Because they're embarrassed. Now, because they're clowns. I do have eyes and ears everywhere. Because people brag too much. And plus, my dead family members help me out too. My ancestors, Shiva, is helping me right now. Minotra. That's a very powerful ancestor. My family's helping me from the dead. I'm very in tuned with the energy. I am very spiritually connected to the Most High. I understand it. But that's pretty fucking sad. I have to sit here and have to clarify with my tarot cards to prove of what you guys are in denial about. And that's what it is. You two would be they trying to embarrass you. It backfired on them now being a clown. You two try to embarrass me, but it came back on you, on yous, because somebody sets you up to pay you off to start with me and Cody. And that's embarrassing. That's like humiliation. Yeah, knock off the bullshit is what Shiva's saying. All you're doing is starting drama. Just knock it off. And I think it's funny that you got my family telling you to stop trying to catch a case. Yeah. That clarifies it too. Stop the bullshit. You just embarrass the fuck out of yourself. And there's a setup going on. Chose to be gay and blaming others. Okay, so if one of you are gay, you can't really blame others for what you chose in life. Being nosy about a person's love life. That is the main problem. People trying to get on my Facebook and tell me that Cody is cheating. But come to find out, there were people doing it back then. They were doing the exact same thing to Cody, saying, oh, Emma's cheating on you. There was no Texas on my phone. So, think about it. There's people being nosy about a love life. Like, pretty much, you just embarrassed yourself. Somebody is making you. They paid you off to be nosy. And someone's being a part of setting somebody up to prove a point that you need to stay out of people's love lives. Somebody is being fake to your face. And that is sad. What else is... Fuck boy, fuck girl. Yeah. You actually got a fuck boy, fuck girl who you know... That is setting you up. That That's the real person that you need to blame here. Because I do got eyes and ears everywhere. Someone is getting passive aggressive. Yeah. Gee, I wonder why. Somebody would be... Someone is getting passive aggressive. Because they just got caught. Because they're humiliating. Yeah. Stop fighting. Yeah. Pretty much. Uh, you guys just embarrassed yourself. Someone is about to go to jail because of fighting. Yeah. I'm going to feel bad because... Okay. Aiding and abetting is supporting to helping others to commit a crime. Encouragement act actions taken to protect the perpetrator. Encouraging someone else to commit a crime. Providing information about the person. Assisting with commission of the crime, acting as a lookout, acting as the getaway driver, propping, help, aiding, assessing, assessing supporting, abetting, furthering, bolstering, nurturing, landing a hand. Yeah, so you guys... Or adding in a bedding. That's what I said. And you can't really make this shit up. Adding in a bedding 
is paid some someone somebody paid you two off to set you up because you're editing and abating and there's somebody about to go to jail for it because you fell for it you are a clown you are being made fun of of not stop screwing with people's relationships and love lives how many times do I got to clarify this shit? Let me see. Is there anything else? Causes problems and runs away like a little bitch. Yeah. That's what it is. Aiding and abating. Actually encouraging the actions to protect the perpetrator. You cannot protect the perpetrator when you got somebody out here. Who is causing problems and runs away like a little bitch? You will catch a case. And that's what Shiva was talking about. And this clarifies with what that guy was talking about. And I'm using his um, tarot thing because I felt like it's a double confirmation of what needs to be put out there. Yeah, plotting and planning. And you guys stupidly fell for it. And you guys are about to go the fuck down. While you guys get blamed wrongfully. And not the correct person. Yeah. Causes problems. And runs away like a little bitch. Also that too. You're fucking with people's energies. When you guys keep messing with me. I'm going to know everything about you. I'm going to know your past. Your present. And your future. I will know what you're doing in the dark. I, it freaks out. I've scared people because I'm so damn accurate. That's how I got people to stop trying to kill me and trying to hurt me. And people who got paid off to start on me. So this is pretty sad that I'm accurate with my gut intuition. It's called... Stop messing with my spiritual waters. Stop messing with me spiritually. And stop doing shit. Because my dead family members are telling me what you're doing. You got Shiva. Shiva's an ancestor. That you're warned to back off of me. And you're not proceeding with caution. Pretty much, you don't care if death comes. You don't care if it brings path of destruction. Some odd reason you two are scared to be struck at. Okay? See? Causes problems and runs away like a little bitch. Because you guys can't dish out what you put out there. What? You can't handle strong ass people? What? Are you weak minded? Are you weak individuals? That you act weak yourself? You're not very strong. If you're scared to get struck at because of what you cause in the first place. You can't be getting paid off by somebody to cause me and Cody problems. And then wants to run away, causes problems and runs away like a little bitch. You're adding and abating. This is supported. And a part of setting somebody up. So I suggest... People better be cautious. Because for some odd reason, you guys cause problems and runs away like a little bitch because you guys don't want to get struck at. That you guys have deceit. You're predators. And they're trying to warn you off. Enemies don't have a realization to back off of people. They are threatened by the underworld Evil by poison, temptation, devil, deceit. They are scared of getting struck at and will be stopped in their tracks. They don't care about approaching the caution or situation approaching of a enemy's death destruction. So somebody is going to start something to where it's going to bring chaos and path of destruction and yeah they hunt at night and the snake is trying to remind them their ego needs to be put under control 
This is my ancestors. You're up in my energy. You're up in my level. And my level ain't your level. You better get the fuck out of my bubble. And you better leave my bubble. And you better leave my energy alone. Because you're, you're fucking with the wrong one. I promise you that. And everything I wrote down and everything I've said in these cards are so accurate of how the fuck I've explained to J-I-Y-A. I confronted you about who the fuck paid you off. You and her. And you sat there and you were in denial. You can't lie to me. My ancestors straight up told. It is exposed. Shit happens in the dark came to the light. I suggest you guys better start speaking the truth and find out who's the main problem here. Because you're not screwing with my love life because somebody paid you off to do it. There's too many people that I have ears and eyes everywhere who pretty much, I'm clairvoyant. And there's people saying that you guys got paid off to cause me and Cody problems on purpose. And that's not okay. That's adding in a betting. I pretty much confirmed it. So, knock off the bullshit. You embarrassed yourself. Because it backfired. You're a clown. Nobody's not going to take you seriously. You're a fuckboy fuck girl. You're very low vibrational. Someone is about to go to jail because of a fight. Causes problems and runs away like a little bitch. Because you guys are shocked that you got caught. I've called out so many people in my lifetime. And I've been right. I've been accurate. I've been on it. So if somebody did set you two up or paid you off, you better find out who the culprit is. And you better find out who the perpetrator is. Because if you don't, you guys are going to get blamed. Just saying. Pretty accurate as fuck. And this is sad. That it pretty much confirmed with this guy's tarot. Right there. There's plotting and scheming going on. Yeah. Proceed with caution. Don't be stupid. Do the right thing. And you are caught. Stop fucking with my energy. I can hear you telepathy, too. I can hear whoever the hell you're talking to. I can hear you. The dead can talk to me. I suggest you better wise up and better find out who the main problem is. Because they're making you guys go down for something that whoever paid you off to do their dirty work. But like I said, I'm going to go ahead and get off here and I hope you guys have a good night.